Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. We are here in Twilight Town where everybody's getting turned into pigs! Let's, uh, put a stop to that. I want to think there's going to be, like, offshoots of the different Paper Mario games. Like, the next one's probably going to be Paper Mario and the Low Poly Pigs. Because it's got to have, you know, some punchiness to it. Paper Mario and... The Scraps Pile. Hmm. Someone's sniffling in here. Uh, looks like a store. Everything's empty. Uh... French pig. <laughs> loink, loink. It's like they misspelled Link's name. And it's clear to see, yes. No! <laughs> <laughs> he really is a chef. <laughs> no, it's ironic. He's still very much a chauvinist, though. Mario, she's bearing her soul to you. Wake up. I'm Mario don't care. And Yoshi's like, I'm listening. I'm very sorry for you, for your loss. <laughs> Yoshi's still very naive and nice. What do you expect? He's only like one week old. <laughs> oh no! No so, key. So, yeah, we gotta go find the key to the storeroom. And it'll get us stuff that we probably need to help us on our journey. So let's go look for him. I like how all the people in this town have like shadows over their eyes. Adds well, to the very, spooky factor. It's a very dark town, you see. Anything in here? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. Guess we'll try to leave. Alright, let's go get his permission then. I could have sworn we had the mayor's permission. Yeah, I thought so too. Okay. Well, you know, whatever. I'll, you know, town's not that big. I'll just go back and get it. Yeah, it smells like pig shit in here. You know, if this chapter doesn't end with a battalion of pigs, I'm going to be very disappointed. I think, uh, that's not going to happen, but I think you won't be disappointed either oh, way. Oh, okay. Well, he's not really giving us permission. He's just kind of saying the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Good crows. Crows with, crows with a chronic cough. That's dark, we're out of here. My god! This is literally the dark chapter. Everybody's so... off. We gotta do something. We gotta save everybody's bacon. <laughs> <clears throat> oh. Oh. Hello there. Oh my god! Well, that's 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 terrible. <laughs> it's just so depressing and dark. Spurn oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I got some food. Uh, let's see, uh, shroom. Uh, Here, have a poison bread. mushroom. H have have some honey syrup. Go ahead and uh, get, get yourself a little glass of syrup for your, for your family. Yeah, here you go. Have you got a shooting star? Oh, cool. We come from the mush. Uh, uh, um. No. What the hell? Oh no! Well, that ain't good. <laughs> that ain't good at all. Oh, it's getting faster. We gotta stop this. Let me through. <laughs> My favorite story is the story of the three little pigs. Ah! Well, now it's like the the seventeen little pigs. At that point, they're going to run out of materials. One built, <laughs> one built his house out of straw. One built his house out of sticks. One out of bricks. One out of polyester. One out of cellophane. One as, soon, out of as soon as we get to the seventeenth, is like, and then he built his house out of I don't know other pigs. And then the seventeenth pig killed the other sixteen pigs, and then built his house out of their bones. Well, uh, 
somebody got turned into a pig just now. I wonder oh. who it was. Oh, I think I know. That's cool. Hey, Mayor. Mayor no! Pig. No! <laughs> no! Oh, God, why? <laughs> as soon as Yoshi said, I wonder who it was, I knew it was going to be the mayor. Oh, man. Well, uh, we, we got his permission. Kinda. <laughs> this is going fast. How long has this city been around? Or how long has it had this problem? Not again! No. No! Oh, no! No! That's <laughs> just... It's too cruel! That's so messed up! If only he would have let us through, he would have been saved. Ugh. Well, at least we can get our way through now, and uh, in this shed... I'm gonna go ahead and switch to Goombella, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some new enemies to title on. We get a black key! Ooh, black key! Black key! That means, uh... Wait, that means we can go into the storeroom, right? Yeah, that's what I got, right? Black, black key? Maybe? Yeah. Yeah, black key. Yeah, right. So, that should go into the storeroom, right? <laughs> Maybe you're just superstitious. Gabella, I know you haven't been here for the entire time. Actually, wait. Do all of our party members know what's going on? Because they're not following behind us, they're just in our pocket. Everybody has something to say. Everybody knows what's going on. Damn it. Because I was really hoping you you bring out, like, Koops at one point, and he just goes, WHAT IS GOING ON?! That's going to be a coding nightmare. I would not oh. wish that upon anybody. Oh, I know, but it would be so funny. It's like, i got to have, you know, different gauges, different variables set up on who's done what, and who's seen what, and all that. And... It'd also be a Let's Play nightmare. Hold oh, on, God. we need to reload a save going into the town, talking to this person, talking to that person, and ah... Uh... Welcome to my, uh, Goombella percent speedrun of Thousand Year Door. <laughs> Stay tuned next week when we do our Koops percent. Is that a zombie Goomba? Aw, oh, dude! Oh, well, it's a tough one! These are all yeah. the Goombas you've killed before, Mario. What are we I, dealing with here? I hope that- wait, what did that say? Haunted? It's a Hyper Goomba! Oh! It's a hyperactive Goomba! Eight? Wow. And he charges his attack to eight! <gasps> oh! Okay. We gotta kill these things! I. Uh, <laughs> Boink. That didn't work. What was that? Terrible. And that's even worse. And now he's invisible. Well. <laughs> oh no! This is going great. Oh, that was pretty good. Yeah, Gumbella's got the super attack power due to me leveling her up and having the badge that ups my partner's attack power. Haha! -ha! Ah! So do do counterattacks work on the invisible guys? It hasn't worked for me yet. Okay. Uh, I'll use Quake Hammer. Damage the guy in the back a little bit too... Vaguely. Uh, eh, that was alright. Oh god, I hate this. Ooh, the fog comes in. This is bullshit because he can hit me, but I can't. What?! How does that That's work? Right. That's alright, I'll just jump on him with my... Nope. Yeah, but he can hit me! That's bullshit! Who's the guy in the back setting off the fog machine? I think this game is biased against me. The player. Oh, well, it's because this is Bowser's play. Actually, it's not even his play. Is there a main character that considers this his stage, his play? Not really. Oh, okay. Because I know, uh... In Super Paper Mario, it was... There was a completely different story going on in the background. Hmm, para hyper Goombas. So I'll take out that guy. Then 
Gumbella can tattle for us. Yeah, it's basically the same thing, but it's got wings now. Yeah, take out the wings. It's a Hyper Paragoomba with wings, yes. Mm-hmm. So we really need this to be upgraded to 1080p so that way they can fit the entire name in the book instead of H. Paragoomba. Oh, good God. Hey, yeah, this is great. Okay. <clears throat> well, we can do that and that. Do you know how much it would suck if you had wings in the same, you know, continuity that these guys have wings? You stub your toe and you lose your ability to fly. That's bullcrap. <laughs> Dodge it! Yeah! Ooh. That was very close. Don't scare me like that. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Ah, See, we're still RPG and like masters here. I just love the fact that these lovely Goombas know how to use Kaioken. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you know, if we're going for the old uh, 1980s show, it'd be It's Koopa Ken! <laughs> <laughs> so these are uh, hyper spiked spiky Goombas. Goombas. <laughs> Same thing, but they can increase their attack to nine! Ay, ay, ay. All right, up in the stakes here. That's come, good. Come on, we got anything that could? Well, just, just do this earthquake. I'm not dealing with this. I love that earthquake is represented by a very mad rock. <laughs> well, isn't that what an earthquake is? An angry rock. Well, it's a little more. Oh, ah! it's it's a little more complicated than that. But uh, you know, at least we could do that for the shorthand. Oh great, he's big and he's got attack boost and power to 9, which means it's probably like 12. Take him down, buddy. I'm taking them both down. Boop. Die. Duck! Man, this stage sucks. <laughs> but... It was decrepit and it was put together by pigs. We're so close to leveling up though, so... Still in good shape. I want to know your thought on something. What's that? Do you think it's okay that Paper Mario went away from the, you know, fight enemies for experience route? Is the game still fun to play? I mean, I hope. If it is, then fine. I mean, again, have you played Origami King at all? Yeah. It's fun. I'm having yeah. a great time. So, uh, I made an uh-oh. What uh-oh did you make? We're going the wrong way. Also, the moon is getting closer. Is it going to have a face? Nah, it's not going to have a face. Got to get that key somehow. That's obviously the key to get back into the storeroom. Mm-hmm. But how do I get it? Well, uh, let's, let's just say that I'm going to do a couple minutes of wandering around, figuring out what to do, and yeah, we'll just crossfade into when I figure it out. So, all right, I, I like went back to town to look for a few things, but it turns out uh, the answer was with me all along. I keep forgetting about Coops. How could you forget about our man? Get that key for me, will you? So this is where okay, the now. game starts to be a little bit, a little bit more hands off with uh, what to do now. Oh shit! That hurts. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Got the foot! Not the foot! Yow! <clears throat> Oh you yeah, the game's gonna it. stop being a uh, you know uh, as helpful as it has been and start being a bit more cryptic, which is it's just fine. It just means I have to have a guide open in another tab. This is what you get for forgetting coops. Yeah, well, I, I'm paying for it. Oh, and so is he. <laughs> oh god. I'm starting to think Mario just likes only a certain companion. Like Yoshi oh, was like. His maternal instincts kicked in, and he's just like, Oh, I love this little Yoshi. And then after Koops so, gets the key, it's like, Back in the pocket with you! I have no fl flower power to do anything with, but I need to take care of these guys because they have an attack power of nine, so I'm just gonna use this. Fuck it! Bip. 
Are you kidding? <laughs> I can actually see pigs, like, activating levers and switches trying to make sure this set doesn't fall on you. Well, uh, we leveled up at least. Uh, let's go with the badge powers. I think we need to get some more cool stuff coming our way. We'll uh, do that a little bit later. <laughs> the subtitles say, Distressed Oink. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what's in the storeroom? Uh, we'll find out. Every everything that they have back there is supposed to help us on our journey, you know, because they close the shop. It's basically their uh, leftover inventory that we can that we get dibs on. What? Why? What? Why is that a thing? What? Oh, co oh, come on! At what point during a play do you just need your players frozen? And now Coops, Coops! is down again. <laughs> See, this is why I forget about Coops. <laughs> oh, now I can't help. No. Oh, come on! Okay. Ow! Uh, oh my God, that hurt. Gah! Okay, I understand. Every time you use something Quake-related, it brings down another part of the set. Well, I like the Quake, all right? Even more of the stage fell down. We need to get, like, some duct tape or Gorilla Glue or something. <laughs> You're bringing down the house, man! It's a great performance! This place is dangerous, man. It turns out Mario was the dangerous one the whole time. He was always the pig. <laughs> Mario the pig, going after multiple princesses in a lifetime. Well, that unlocks the door, thankfully. And we got some items back here as as well as a... Oh, oh damn! Woo! So we got Ooh. quite a few things. And a defend plus. Oh, oh defense perfect. One. You know, you know, now'd be a good time to look at some badges. Yeah, what that's what I'm here. thinking. Defend plus is five. Dear God. Hmm. Uh, what, do we, what can we do for now? Let me see here. Yeah, power bounce. You know, in a right. place like this, I think sounding like a cricket would be perfect. <laughs> uh, Actually, do they have one so we can sound like a pig? I, I, I don't know. I don't think so. <laughs> Slam into a Goomba. Oink! Well, I'll stick with Power Bounce for now. In the meantime, let's go get cursed again. <gasps> Another curse! I have a feeling it's paper-related. You're going to curse me! You know what? What do you think? Should we open it? Yeah! At this point, yeah. I want to hear the story about how these cursed beings got stuck in chests. Maybe they're just misunderstood. Well, I'm just thinking, it seems like everybody in this game gets a backstory. I mean, even Luigi's having his own adventure off to the side, so why not these treasure demons? You think that lamp in the back left corner has a backstory? Hell yeah! There's a reason they keep a lamp in a locked area. Oh, uh, yeah, by, by, by the way, we're cursed again. Darn, how does this keep happening? The cursiest curse ever. Curse Saint Curse. I love the descriptors. Ah! Oh no! Now, I'll be honest, if this happened to, like, an actual human person, all of these curses would suck, but this wall of curse just happened to, you know, bewitch the one guy made of paper. Not only are they cursed, you know, to be, you know, curse givers, but cursed in the paper world where their curses don't really have much, uh, cursey, they're more beneficial than hindrances. So now we can turn to a cardboard tube! Mario unlocked the morph ball, or wait, morph tube morph wrapping paper. 
Huh, do that was weird. Back. That's it. <laughs> Hey, you do know the thing in the back room is cursed. Oh, yeah, I should have told you not to open that. It's just my husband knew how to open it without getting cursed. <laughs> the curse turned him into a pig. Oh, your results may vary. We'll stop by the inn here for a sec. In where? In the inn. In where? In the inn crowd. Are you in? Internationally. Run. Don't be so indignant. That's indisputable. Don't be so incendiary. <laughs> I'm on fire! Oh, God! That's incredible! Oh, my God, you're faster! A little bit. Oh. Got an email. Hello? So check the old email here. Check my email. Check my email. Hey, check Mario, it, did it, you know you could turn into a paper tube? Oh, just already missed you three. Uh, 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 access Express ran late for the first time in ten years today as a special incident at activated station security measures area. Youth and huge train enthusiast Lackey was found taking pictures in an employee, employee area in the Express. It was gang tackled by local Samaritans. I understand <laughs> how much people are into trains, but we've got a safety security to uphold. Blustered into the train engineer. The youth was released with this time. Just a warning, just time. Just before we go. Let's feel sales stall. Though they've never attracted as many customers as the nearby hot dog stand, the proprietor is certain that any day now people will in fact notice that he it does exist. Early on in our interview, the owner of the nearby hot Duck stand corner reporter and had this to say who needs to, who needs to let's go I, I went too fast damn it apparently everyone in Glitzville knows how to roll with a punch cooking for rookies hey there rookies flex your <laughs> bendy straws because today is fresh juice you just take honey syrup and you stir it and then you get juice editor's note there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff here yes thank you for that distraction I don't know what's happening in a place that I'm not at right now and I don't want to be Let's cardboard tube all the way across this map. What do you say? Rolling around at the... Uh, it's too obvious. Oh, wow, you have full 3D movement, too. Yeah, but it's not perfect, though. Like, trying to <laughs> avoid... Ah! <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Okay. And then we just roll underneath. All right. See, I honestly thought the next curse we were going to get was just us... Like, going to sleep. You know the animation where we just slide into bed? Yeah. I thought we were going to be able to do that, but, like, out out in the world. Well, what the hell do I do here now? Set it on fire! You don't have fire. It would be an ingenious thing to come up with. Gotta use flurry. Oh, just, yeah, blow it. Oh, there we go, the house made of straw. Well, that's the first, uh, Three Little Pigs house. Ooh, there you are. Now we go into the woods. Hey, are we gonna run into some cool cats who have a dark past? Hell yeah. Now we're gonna yeah. run into some evil flowers. Oh, good. Haven't seen you since Yoshi's Island, flower power. Underline evil flowers. How evil are they? Well, not only do we have two hyper-powered Goombas backing her up, but, uh, she does something really mean. Alright, I wanna see this. I wanna see evil. This is Crazy Daisy! HP is 7, attack is 2, no, no defense. But it's got a lullaby that will put no. a whole shit ton of sleep on you. No, I hate And it runs away, too. Status. I hate ah. it. No! Ah! Okay. Of course, this yeah, is the kind of bad. game where if you get hit, it doesn't wake you up. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, I hate that. So I hate that. This no! Is so ah! bad. But fortunately, the lullaby again wakes you up. So ah, oh, god! Nine? Holy shit! My uh, god! Uh, okay, Mario's gonna be asleep for four more turns. <laughs> and I don't have. I use my last crap. stone quake. Damn it! Ah, oh, god! Thunderbolt! Duck! Stop putting people to sleep! Ah! Ooh. Oh god! Ah! That's killed her! Because he's powered up. Okay. Oh god, what am I gonna do? Uh. 
Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. uh, it could make him dizzy. See how well that works. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's a weird effect. Nope. <laughs> oh, hey, it woke you up. And he's powered up. Great. Well, that's cool. It does wake you up. I was gonna power smash this guy, get him dead as quickly as possible. Duh! Duh! I hate this. I hate this fucking stage. <laughs> Come on, just a little more. There we go. Ha ha! Okay. It worked that time. There we go. Sheesh. See, you did it. God, man. Okay, we're not gonna underestimate fucking flowers in the Mario universe anymore, correct? No, we're not. Okay. No, we're not. Okay, alright. Make our way through here. Nothing back that way. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, yes. thank God, an earthquake. That'll really help us out. And then another crazy daisy. Yep. Because I'm crazy. And there's... Uh-oh. <laughs> you know... <sighs> yeah, great. Boom! Ow! <laughs> Why? I just... <laughs> Oh, no! I love, I love random pieces just falling. Oh, please get it. No. I'm very concerned that I keep getting... Oh, I got the timing right. But I'm very uh, concerned that I keep getting the poison mushroom. When I do those roulettes. You're gonna have a curse put upon you. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! And wow, that is their only attack. How can a lullaby miss in the fog? Well, maybe it's like Pokemon rules. If you have one status effect, you can't get the other one. Well, it is true. I am electrified. Oh. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kamala, you're not looking so good. You need, you need some help. Definitely. Bip! There we go. Good lord. Sheesh. Welcome to Crazy Daisy's Crazy Emporium. I'll sing you to sleep and fuck your life up. Uh, and then uh, run away. I thought you'd give the medicine that heals me when I lose all my hearts. You didn't heal. Oh god, not one of these guys. I'm not dealing with that today. Not dealing with it. Can't deal. Won't deal. Earthquake! There you are, go! Those trees are coming down, by the way. Damn it! Oh. I hate that you're right. Can we no. just work in like a black box theater or maybe just like a coliseum? <laughs> well, a coliseum, people would be like chucking tomatoes and spears at you. Well, it's better than rocks. Well, that's true. Hammer throw. Ooh. That's actually very important for later. Cool. Is that a badge or what is it? That's a badge. Oh, okay. And it looks like a dead end, so we have to go back. But there is no way to go back. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Um. Are you kidding? Quick, try everything. Come Turn on. into every shape. Uh. <sighs> It's got to be here. Come on, thicket. It was really so, so scary. Yeah, the fact that the game's not telling me what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Didn't tell me any kind of visual <laughs> clue whatsoever. I don't fucking... Hang on! You know, I really hate when the answer is deceptively simple, and it just overstates me. I have now forgotten about Flurry. Because, were you supposed to know that you're supposed to blow this tree? I didn't! 
Whatever, here we are now. You know, that's really not a good message to send everybody. When in doubt, blow. Yeah. I'm gonna stick with Yoshi, uh, Goomba. Looks like she's, uh, hurting a little while. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what the hell now? Ugh, come on. There's a spot there. There's a rock here. I can't get through. What do you want me to... Well, time okay, to blow. Maybe, maybe I gotta use flurry to blow. No. Uh, oh my god. Come on. What do I do now? Can I, I roll know, under? I know you're more gamer than this, dude. I know you can figure this out. What do you think I'm supposed to do, smart guy? I don't know, I'm not the one playing! You have any ideas? Come on, I'm waiting! Um, honestly, I forget what everybody's abilities are, so... If it's not blow... Right! Have, not... Fur have Flurry blow this! <laughs> yeah, there you go! Well, I was partially right. That's dumb! That's dumb! <laughs> what about here? You can't get over that! You just push? <laughs> you can't jump over it? Do I got No! Can't jump over it! What do I do? What do I do? Go over Can I, like, it? jump to the other, other side? That no, I gotta go this way. I'm supposed to push it. Yeah, that that's what the... That's what it's looking like. There you go! Well, that's kind of obtuse. <laughs> yeah! It's suddenly being really obtuse. It didn't need to be. Oh wait! Uh. Ah! There we go. Ah! Whoa! No! Not dealing with you. I don't want to. Go away. Well, finally, we're here at Creepy Steeple. I assume the source of the pig bell, or whatever you want to call it. And, uh, thankfully, there is a place to heal. Thankfully, there's a place to save. Huh. <sighs> Let's just get the crystal star and get out of here. I am with I'm with you 100%, y'all. She Ah, it feels wonderful. Like that we save then we're good. <laughs> Phew. Ah, you made it. We did make it. So, next time on Pit Mario the Thousand Year Door, we're going to check out the creepy steeple. See you next time. Spooky.